Like I already mentioned, the full output remapping in INAV, just like it's happening in Betaflight, it's not very likely to happen. Of course, if someone, if the independent developer will decide to do something about it, then I'm super happy to help assist and in general, I'm all in for this feature. However, for the INAV 5.0, I have prepared something new and this is the option to completely remap all the outputs to all the files functions. Right now, for example, if you take a flight controller, it might have first four output mapped as the motors and the next two output maps as the servos. With INAV 5, you will be able to force either motors or either servos on all of the outputs. In the auto mode, the current mapping will be implemented just like it's defined for any target. If you will force motors, then motors will be mapped as motors and the servos will be mapped as motors. And if you choose servos, then all the servo outputs will be still servos but all the motor output will be also used as the servos. You will not be able to mix uh, them, but uh, in some of the cases this should solve at least some of the problems. And on top of that, I'm not sure if you know, but that if you are using, for example, the airplane, you are fully capable of driving the motor with the servo output. The motor connected motor that drives your airplane does not really have to be connected to the motor output to be able to control the ESC because every ESC can read the standard PWM protocol that is used to communicate with the servers. 